is there a real benefit to getting a COVID vaccine booster? Tonight, a local health system says its study finds the answer is a resounding yes. Our Dr. Frank McGeorge here with a closer look at who it studied and what it found. Good evening, Doc. Hey, Karen and Jason. Yeah, you know, this is a really important question because of the people in Michigan who are fully vaccinated, only around 53% have received a booster. Researchers at Beaumont Health wanted to see if the booster shots were reducing deaths from COVID across their eight hospitals. And they found among their hospitalized COVID patients, those who had received a booster were 45% less likely to die compared to those who were unvaccinated. The main outcome that we were interested in is was death, so in hospital mortality. And the numbers were, you know, were significant. Lead researcher Dr. Amit Ball and his team studied more than 8,200 Beaumont patients hospitalized due to COVID from August of last year to January of this year. The study was published in the Lancet Regional Health Americas. It found in the unvaccinated hospitalized patients, the mortality rate was 12.8%. For the fully vaccinated patients, it was 10.3%. But in the fully vaccinated and boosted patients, the mortality rate was just 7.1%. What we found was that there's a definite added benefit in terms of mortality getting boosted. That's in spite of the fact that the hospitalized patients who were boosted tended to be older and have more pre-existing health problems. Even if you were uh, older or you had higher degree of comorbidity, so baseline risk was higher, you're a sicker individual, you still had an added mortality benefit by getting boosted. Researchers hope this real-world data will encourage more people to get that extra layer of protection. I think that the, the message is, is, is very clear. So if you're fully vaccinated and you're not boosted, get boosted. Now, a third of the people in the booster group who got sick actually developed symptoms within 12 days of receiving their booster. So they likely did not have the full benefit of that booster shot yet, which means the booster may be even more effective at reducing the risk of death than this study even suggests. Did, Frank, did it matter which booster they got? Was that part of the study? Interesting question. You know, the majority of the patients had received actually one of the mRNA vaccines as their booster. And between Pfizer and Moderna, the researchers actually didn't find any differences in protection. But they didn't look specifically at mixing and matching or the various combinations of shots that people had received, just whether or not they had received a booster, basically. Yeah. Good stuff. All right. Doc, thanks.